Hey, Jacob here, Authentic Gay Blog. How you doing? Yeah, do the thing. That's the only way I get taken seriously in it. <laughs> um, okay, this is a vlog about attraction. Okay, um, I've mentioned on numerous occasions that um, I've not had sex for 20 months. Um, and that sex was pretty shit and pretty crap, uh, mainly because I wasn't actually attracted to the guy. And um, advice from friends was like, well, maybe have sex with people you're not attracted to, you know, and the attraction will build. So I did that. Um, and it was crap. There was no connection. I may as well have just had a wank on my own, actually, probably would have been more enjoyable. And basically, so, I've not had much sex and one of the main reasons is that because I only have sex with guys I am physically attracted to or have some kind of connection with. And yes, as I've just said um, a minute ago, I have challenged that belief, I've challenged that perception. and. Um, it don't work for me okay I'm not going to apologize for the type of guys that I'm attracted to I'm not attracted to effeminate camp guys um, it doesn't do anything for me down there you know I like masculine men I'm not going to apologize but I'm not judging these guys as inferior or less than or unworthy or anything like that all I'm saying is that I'm just not attracted to them sexually on a sexual basis, okay? So I'm trying to get decent lights because this is a shit laptop. Uh, it don't do anything for me. And likewise, you know, I like guys about my height, mainly because when I kiss someone, my eyes are open, I want to be looking into their eyes, I don't want to be having to do that. Um, to kiss someone, I like a boy bitch to be in the same place, you know. Um, when you're having someone or having sex, it means it's a lot easier, everything's in the same place, or pretty much in the same place, if you know what I mean. And you know, I work out and I go to the gym, and I like I'm a big built, I like I'm a big built bloke. That's why one of the reasons I go to the gym, you know, apart from that, I really enjoy going to the gym. I have pleasure in working out and lifting heavy weights and lifting heavier and heavier weights. You know, I recently reached a milestone, which is a milestone for me, and I benched 108 kilos, that's 240 pounds, and did three sets of 12. So I enjoy pushing myself and doing stuff like that. But, you know, I like, and I'm sexually attracted to predominantly masculine orientated kind of big blokes, that's the way I am, that's how my sexual whatever is orientated towards, you know, and um, I'm not going to apologise for that, and I'm not going to be made to be feel less than, and likewise, you know, every time someone sends me a woof or a message, Every time, so every single person who woofs me, sends me a message, cruises, whatever the little thing is on the individual apps, I reply with a thank you. Even though I am not sexually attracted to that individual, I thank them for the compliment of them being attracted to me and doing that because. But it's just a decent, grown-up, masculine thing to do. And um, on odd occasions, when people take the message further and indicate they will have sex with me and I turn them down, on occasions they get abusive. One guy yesterday, or was it yesterday or Friday, I can't remember what day it was, I said... Um, he said, oh, we should hook up and have sex. And I said, no, thanks, mate, you know. And he sent me a message just basically saying, you ugly, munted cunt, how dare you be so fucking selective. 
you know, and that's fine. It didn't bother me. It didn't bother me. So before you put comments down below, it didn't bother me, okay? I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. I grew up in care. I got taken away from my parents. If I can handle that, I can handle a shitty little comment from a, a, a fucking little faggot queen that, that couldn't accept rejection. <laughs> I could, you know? Um, so, I do it nicely. I turn people down nicely with congruence and niceness and um, good vibes, you know? So, really, you know, no one should apologise for the type of guy that they're attracted to and what they're attracted to. It's what you're attracted to. It's not a judgment on that individual or that person. But the only thing is, is if you turn people down or you get turned down, is, you know, please, you know, either don't respond or respond nicely about it because it's not about you personally. It's not personal towards you. It's not a personal attack on you. It's just that person isn't attracted to you, you know, like you're not attracted to certain people as well you know so you wouldn't like it um if that person responded to you with an abusive message would you know exactly so you know just like and embrace what and who you are attracted to and allow other guys to like and embrace who and what they're attracted to as well thank you